Please remember, only do these guided meditations in a place that is safe. Do not listen to these while driving or operating machinery. Find a comfortable place to relax just in case you fall asleep during the meditation. Let's begin. I invite you to have a seat either on the floor with your legs crossed or in a chair with your feet on the floor. I invite you to close your eyes and take a moment before we start breathing. We are going to breathe with five to six seconds on the inhale and five to six seconds on the exhale to stimulate parasympathetic tone, rest, digest, relax. Shall we begin? Inhale. And exhale. Inhale. And exhale. Inhale. And exhale. Breathe in and breathe out. Continue this breathing pattern of five to six seconds on the inhale and five to six seconds on the exhale. And if you notice that your breathing has deviated, it's okay. Just bring your concentration back to your breathing and return to this pattern. Imagine a small light between your eyes further back inside your head. A small light of awareness. A small light of consciousness. Focus your attention on that light. Feel its presence. As you breathe, allow the light to travel down to your feet. Focus this light your mind's eye on your feet. Illuminate them and check in with your feet. How do they feel? What are your feet telling you right now? Your toes, the balls of your feet, the ankles, the heel. They carry you throughout this world, support your weight, support your thoughts, support your dreams, support your ambitions. They help you stand even when you don't feel like standing. 
They help you walk when you feel you may be stumbling. They help you run forward into a life of improved mental health, physical well-being, and most importantly, purpose. Thank you, Feet. Thank you for all you do for me. If there are any pains in your feet, take a moment to allow the light to shine upon that pain. Within every pain there is a lesson. What can you learn? Allow the light to travel up to your calves, to your shin, your lower legs. Notice any feelings that you might have, any tightness, any pain, or maybe you feel great. Take a moment to thank those muscles for allowing your ankles to flex and extend, allowing you to walk Now imagine the light moving up to your knees. How do your knees feel? Are they in pain? If they are, allow the light to focus upon that pain. healing energy from your mind, from your heart, to your knees. The knees that allow you to walk, that support you as you squat, allow you to sit. They take a lot of pressure. They do so faithfully. Take a moment to thank your knees for serving you. As you continue to breathe for five to six seconds on the inhale, five to six seconds on the exhale, Allow the light to move upward to your thighs, your quadriceps, your hamstrings, your glutes. Notice any sensations that you might have knots, any strains, or balance. These are some of the most powerful muscles in your entire body. And though they are far from our brain and from our heart. They do so much great work for us. Take a moment to thank your upper legs, your glutes, for allowing you to sit 
to stand, to squat, to walk, to run, to live the way you want to live. Now let's allow the light to move up to our lower back. As you sit right now with your back straight, notice any sensations that you have in your lower back. Any strains, any pains or balance. So many of us walk around this world with back pain, especially in our lower back. It's a part of the body that's so easy to take for granted until it needs a break. So why not take a moment right now to express your gratitude for your low back. Your vertebra, your lumbar, sacrum. Your core muscles. Thank you, low back. Thank you for serving. Allow the light to move further up to your middle upper back. Notice any sensations that you may have. Any pains any strains, any knots, or balance. Notice your scapulas, your shoulder blades. Are they forward? Or are they coming together with your shoulders back? Focus on your thoracic vertebrae, your spinal column, the middle of your back, up to the top. Notice any sensations in your back. Your back that literally keeps you upright. supports your vision, supports your dreams. Your foundation. It is the source of strength, the source of information passing through. source of power. Thank you back. Now move the light to your lower abdomen, middle abdomen. Notice any sensations. Any pain. Any 
discomfort. Allow the light of focus to shine upon the abdomen. All the organs it holds. Further in the back, your kidneys. Filtering. Providing balance. Eliminating waste. Your bladder. Your reproductive organs doing their jobs. Shine light upon your adrenals. They work so hard for you. Here's a moment to say thank you. Shine the light upon your liver, serving countless functions in your body. detoxifying you. Thank you, lover. Your spleen. Shine the light through your digestive tract. From your stomach through the 20 plus feet of small intestine, through your colon, and all the trillions of bacteria that live peacefully in our gut, helping us by producing the neurotransmitters we need. with our immune function. Producing hormones in the form of short-chain fatty acids and more that regulate other functions in our body. They live with us. We give them a home. They give us life as we know it. To all the friendly bacteria in our gut, shine the light and say thank you. As the light moves upward, imagine it filling your lungs each time you breathe with five to six seconds on the inhale, five to six seconds on the exhale. oxygen that every cell in our body needs. And much like the kidneys, eliminating waste. The carbon dioxide that we produce sent out through the lungs. Imagine as you breathe in, the light illuminating every molecule of oxygen. As that spreads through your blood, 
throughout the rest of your body. With the breath, we create mindfulness. With the breath, we have life. With the breath, we can change everything. Thank you, lungs. Take a moment as I invite you to place your hands on your heart as the light flows to your heart. This heart of yours has been serving you since before the day you were born. This heart of yours has not taken a moment off, let alone a day off. This heart has never asked for a vacation. This heart has never asked for a break, never complained. This heart has pumped blood, which contains the oxygen, the nutrients, the hormones, the minerals that your body needs in every cell, such a vital function. This heart beats for you regularly. It adapts for you when you're moving quickly and exercising, it works harder. And even when you're sleeping, it continues to work for you. Take a moment right now as you feel your heart with your hands, as the light shines upon it. What feelings do you have toward your heart right now? Thank you, heart. Thank you. Allow the light to flow to your shoulders, to your biceps, to your triceps, your elbows. What sensations do you feel in your upper arms, your joints? Notice any tension, any pain. Send the healing energy to those areas. Allow the light now to travel down your forearms. To your wrists. Notice any sensations, pain, and release. Allow the light to illuminate your hands. These hands. What they allow you to do is remarkable.
They allow you to do your job. They allow you to communicate to others through your phone, through your keyboard. They allow you to pick up your toothbrush in the morning and the evening. They allow you to pick up your car keys, your wallet. They allow you to pick up your weights. Such amazing, amazing tools that we have. Let's take a moment to express gratitude for your hands. Thank you, hands. Send the light to your neck, your cervical vertebrae, the neck that quite literally holds your head up high. We spend so much time bending this neck forward to look at our phones, to look down. Allow your neck to expand and peer forward. There's so much life out in front of you. Allow your neck to experience the extension. And now we return the light back into our head. Illuminating from within all the complex processes that take place, sight, smell, Perception of sound, taste, touch, and the thoughts. The conscious and unconscious. It is said that we can experience five conscious thoughts at a time. Hundreds of unconscious thoughts. What a miracle this brain is. It is the most powerful thing in your world. It can serve you in so many wonderful ways. And, if not nurtured properly, It has the intelligence to show you that it needs help. Maybe that shows up as anxiety. Maybe it shows up as depression. Maybe it shows up as stress. But this brain is miraculous. And if you take care of it, it will take care of you. Take a moment to revel in the fact that this brain allows you to have a relationship with the past that we call memories. What if you couldn't remember the past? and all you could experience was right now. What if this brain wasn't able to foresee the future and you could never plan? This brain is a miracle. Your brain is outstanding. Nurture it. Love it, and it will serve you. Allow the light to spread throughout your brain, throughout your head.
Take a moment to thank that light of consciousness that has traveled throughout your whole body, giving gratitude and healing. And when you are ready, I invite you to open your eyes. I'm Dr. Karthik Ramanan. I help ambitious individuals and self-criticism with tools and strategies like meditation to create everyday mental health. If you enjoyed this, please subscribe for more. Until next time, I believe in your greatness.